Hey guys, it's Timmy, and this is Pro Wrestling Unlimited. So for months now, word going around was that eventually, Natalia would turn heel on Ronda Rousey, have a full heel turn, and then challenge her for the championship. We did see Natalia challenge Ronda Rousey for the championship this past Monday on Monday Night Raw, but the heel turn aspect of this was actually nixed when Natalia's father, Jim the Anvil Nightheart, actually passed away. Actually, when Jim Neidhart passed away, it changed a number of plans between Natalia and Ronda Rousey. According to Dave Meltzer in this week's Wrestling Observer Newsletter, he does go on to report that the heel turn by Natalia would have eventually led to the top women's match at WrestleMania 35. This would have seen Natalia turn on her friend and challenge Rousey at WrestleMania for the Raw Women's Championship. Meltzer goes on to state that a number of factors did take this plan off the table. He also noted that it would not have been the actual main event of WrestleMania, as at the time Roman Reigns was slated in for that spot against whoever he was in a program with. Meltzer would go on to state that the rumors of Charlotte Flair being promised the WrestleMania main event is not true. At one point, there were talks of Rousey vs. Flair at WrestleMania, but there were never enough to actually lock it in. Once Becky Lynch became the white hot, or you could say straight fire, red hot superstar that she is, they really wanted her to work with Rousey. When Becky Lynch was injured by Nia Jax and unable to work Survivor Series, that was almost a blessing in disguise because now the plan is for Rousey to face Lynch at WrestleMania. With Lynch now possibly challenging Rousey at WrestleMania, it does give them more time to properly grow this feud. The word right now also is that Charlotte Flair will be challenging Ronda Rousey at the Royal Rumble on January 27th. Now, you may ask, well, how did they get there? Vince McMahon did appear on SmackDown and told both Becky and Charlotte basically quit your bitching and just go challenge her, do something about it. With this new fresh start, he basically said, hey, I've given you the green light to go over, show up on Raw, attack her, and challenge her. In theory, that would be a good way to get the match set up at the Royal Rumble between Rousey and Charlotte Flair. As far as how you get to Rousey versus Lynch at Mania, maybe. Becky Lynch can go on and win the Royal Rumble, or after the Royal Rumble, be like, hey, Charlotte Flair couldn't get the job done, now I'm coming to Monday Night Raw and I want to challenge you, but not just anywhere, at WrestleMania. So we'll see how they get there. It looks pretty obvious how they could get to the Royal Rumble match, but how they get to that match at WrestleMania is the interesting one. But that's going to do it for this episode of Pro Wrestling Unlimited. Remember to comment below, like, and share this video. Like us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Subscribe here on YouTube and follow PWUnlimited.net for the latest in pro wrestling news.